Reptiles captivate many people, but unfortunately, many people are at a loss to identify the reptiles they may observe. This documentary has been prepared in an effort to educate the public about the many reptiles found at Autry Mill Nature Preserve. For the purposes of this documentary, we will use the colloquial definition for reptiles rather than the phylogenetic definition. Technically speaking, the group reptiles not only includes turtles, lizards, crocodiles, and the tuatara, but birds as well. Using this definition, there are three types of reptiles found in the study area, snakes, lizards, and turtles. Worldwide, reptiles fill a variety of roles in a vast array of habitats. Totaling 9,000 species, not including birds, reptiles have contributed heavily to the evolutionary and natural history of the world. Autry Mill Nature Preserve is found in the city of Johns Creek, located in Fulton County of North Georgia. Approximately 46 acres in size, the preserve is characterized by a forest dominated by pines, oaks, sweet gums, and tulip trees. South Creek drains the area, and there are a number of small wetlands associated with it. Nineteen species of non-avian reptile have been documented within the borders of, of the preserve. This includes four species of lizard, four species of turtle, and eleven species of snake. Let's take a closer look at some of them. The green of knoll is a familiar lizard that is commonly seen in the gardens and on fence posts. Insectivorous, these lizards hunt for small-bodied invertebrates as food. Commonly but incorrectly called chameleons, these lizards are capable of modest color change. Five lined skinks are the familiar striped lizards, often seen darting quickly under cover as one passes them. The young have bright blue tails, which helps to draw a predator's attention away from the head. Though the tails may break off if grasped, they generally grow back, though the regenerated tail will lack the blue color of the original. Fence lizards are perhaps the fastest lizards in the preserve. Attaining high temperatures by basking, these lizards hope to be able to outrun their predators. Their cryptic coloration allows them to escape detection from all but the sharpest eyed predators. Box turtles are the only terrestrial species found in our range. Though they are not large, they are protected well by their hard shell. This shell includes a hinge on the plastron, which allows these turtles to not only withdraw into their shell, but to close the shell once they are inside. Omnivorous by nature, these turtles have a number of favorite food sources, including earthworms and blackberries. Named for their habit of sliding into the water when alarmed, slider turtles are often seen basking on rocks and logs near water. Though not found often within the preserve, significant weather events and droughts often cause these turtles to turn up in the creek. Omnivorous by the time they are adults, young turtles primarily consume invertebrates to help maximize their growth. The largest turtle in our region is the common snapping turtle. Though smaller than its cousin, the alligator snapping turtle, the common snapping turtle can reach 50 pounds in weight, consuming a wide variety of prey species. Fish, snakes, turtles, and even ducks may be consumed by snapping turtles. The musk turtle is typically an inhabitant of ponds, but they are sometimes observed in the creek. Musk turtles are more apt to walk along the bottom of the water than swim through it as they search for food. Small by aquatic turtle standards, these turtles rarely exceed four inches in length.
Midland water snakes are the most commonly encountered snake species in the preserve. Being very flexible in habits, these snakes may be found in virtually any aquatic habitat. Commonly confused with the venomous cottonmouth, which is not found in the preserve, these harmless serpents fill an important role in our aquatic habitat. Archie Mill Nature Preserve is home to a second species of water snake, the red-bellied water snake. These snakes are inhabitants of wetlands where they specialize in predating upon frogs. Red-bellied water snakes are declining in numbers across their range due to habitat destruction. Only one venomous snake is found in the preserve, the copperhead. Copperheads are one of the most cryptic of all snakes. Waiting on the forest floor, they are all but invisible. Important components of the ecosystem, copperheads prey upon rodents, reptiles, and amphibians, and are, and are themselves an important component of the diet of red-tailed hawks. Another threat to the copperhead is, east, is the eastern king snake. Immune to the venom of the copperhead and a powerful constrictor, these snakes can consume copperheads, almost matching their length. Besides consuming snakes, eastern king snakes will eat a variety of prey items including amphibians, invertebrates, reptiles, and their eggs. The black rat snake is the largest snake found in the preserve, attaining six feet or more in length. Preying on a variety of rodents and birds, these snakes are, a, are quite accomplished climbers. Powerful constrictors, these snakes are able to subdue root, rodents. Humans have long been fascinated by reptiles. Though many people are intimidated or frightened by reptiles, through education, people often learn to appreciate these species. Though most reptiles are harmless, lay persons are discouraged from interacting with wild reptiles. Instead, people are encouraged to participate in educational programs led by knowledgeable instructors. Now that you are more familiar with the reptiles that call Autry Mill home, we encourage you to visit the preserve and see what reptiles you may observe.